Hi guys, Sabrina from Campbell's Freedom Farm. And we're gonna talk about figs and why they don't ripen. We all buy these fig trees and we wait and we take care of them and the fruit appears, but it never ripens. That's what happened at Shangri-La Botanical Gardens and Nature Center. Um, when we went there, they had that cold spell coming in and they had asked what was the cause every year for these particular fig trees that never ripened. So let me show you some. Let's pretend this is the fig area. Only this row on the top never ripens. And they have, the first thing you have to look at is there enough time for them to ripen? Yeah, they're all the way in the south. There's plenty of warm spell. The rest of the fig trees all ripen on time. So the next thing you wanna look at is, are there insects? Is there a disease? Well, let's look at the leaves. I looked at the leaves, the leaves are perfect. There is nothing. Besides that, all the other fig trees behind it have ripened. So the third thing that you need to look at is the water and tem temperature situation. Now, it had been a drought for many years there. So what I'm gonna assume is they have water lines, I assume underneath, and they added this row because they're always adding and that water line stops here. And these roots for figs are very shallow. They can't handle um, changes in temperature and the lack or overwatering actually. And um, I assume that they're not getting the water because otherwise they look pretty healthy. Now, I wanted to show them how to ripen them very quickly, but they closed the garden and started covering things for that horrible temperatures they were getting. They're not meant to have 17 degree temperatures. So, but we decided to do the video anyway. Now, if you have a fig, and we're gonna assume this tomato <laughs> is a fig, this one's ripened and it's totally developed. If it's totally developed, because let's think about what makes it develop. It's a, to ripen and to develop, a fig tree needs a natural gas called ethylene. If the ethylene keeps escaping and it never stays in because the fig tree is stressed, like lack of water, which is what I think. The eye, not where the vines hook to it, but the eye will leak out the ethylene. So what you could do, and this only works for developed fruit, is you use any edible oil such as olive oil, coconut oil, and you put a Q-tip in there and over that eye, you could dab that on and make sure it's on there pretty good. Now, it should, if it's developed all the way, should ripen within two days or within a week. Now, if you have a cold spell come in like they were and there was no time for it to ripen, fig trees are called climatric. What does that mean? Climatric fruit means it will ripen once it's developed on or off the tree or the vine, such as a tomato. This tomato ripened off the um, vine because um, my tomato plant had died while I was gone. Still developed. So if there's a cold spell coming and you know it's not gonna make it the time to ripen, take it in, put it on a room temperature um, windowsill or a countertop and it'll ripen. Now, 
Let's talk about those fig trees at the Shangri-La Botanical Garden and Nature Center. If they were mine, I would fertilize this spring all the fig trees. And secondly, I would um, redo the water lines. One, there could be a leak, or two, they need to bypass these fig trees and come on the other side because those temperatures there are really extreme in the south. So they need to totally circle these fig trees as these are. And I think that would solve the problem. So let me know if you've had any problems with your fig trees, but this week we're also, it's time to start rooting some fig trees. And um, this year we're gonna do the Chicago hardy fig tree. So I'll see you then, have a great day. Thumbs up please.